racetrack for him. John's passion for giving back to fans and those less fortunate than himself grew from his tremendous appreciation for the sacrifices his family made to take care of him as a child and the sacrifices he, Louis, and the team made to make it in racing. Each year, John Force Racing's Chips for Kids event with the California Highway Patrol draws thousands of people who spend the day at the Yorba Linda facility in California to enjoy a phenomenal car show and bring gifts for children in need. In 2009, over 6,000 gifts were donated to children who might otherwise experience a Christmas without anything special. I can remember wanting a football uniform the, when the Rams were in California, Los Angeles Rams. And that football uniform sat down in a Western Auto store. And Louie rallied my brothers and sisters and they went to my mom and said, dad was in the hospital. She worked over at that time at a donut shop. We ate lots of donuts as a kid, all we could eat. But we lived in a little trailer house in Bell Gardens. And everybody gave up their gifts. Nobody was gonna get nothing. You're not gonna make me cry. Louie was getting nothing for Christmas. I think my sister got something to make sure that I got that, because $14 <coughs> was, was what the family spent at Christmas. And I never forget that Christmas, that somebody took care of me, okay? When I got my chance to do this show, when you see those little kids wanting that toy at Christmas, I'll go till I die and so will Louie. We will do this show, you know what I mean? And we will raise toys for the children. I got mine because I had a family that rallied to make sure I got it. But what about the kid that doesn't? So at the end of the day, if we can do a good thing at Christmas, and we worked here for weeks putting this show together, Louie brought down his trophies to put on display. We all come down here, we work, and you know what I mean? But that's because we care. <coughs> and there is a lot of car clubs here that come, and I ask them, why do you do it? Because they've all lived it. A lot of the people in the car industry that are hot rod people, they all come from, from poverty. And you know why the hot rods? Because it was a way of life. If you were poor and didn't have a big fancy house or a swimming pool, you could have a hot rod. And even if it was a junker, you can bring it to the show and you might win. Because there's all the different categories, men or women. That's why we do this show. And it's because of what Louie and, 